Authorities in Montgomery County say thieves are using an unusual method to steal from stores. Gift bags are being stuffed with items and then the suspects simply walk out the door. Action News reporter Charles Watson joining us live tonight at Ambler with the latest on what we're learning about this. Charles. Yeah, great. Police are calling these guys the birthday bag bandits because that's what they're allegedly using to steal goods from CVS locations like this one here behind me. And so far, police say these guys have gotten away with more than $5,000 worth of stolen merchandise. Take a look at these photos. Northampton Township Police say these men are behind multiple retail thefts at CBS stores in Richboro, Ben Salem, and Ambler. They could be making an awful lot of money illegally, as smart as some of these people are. The suspects, known to police as the birthday bag bandits, allegedly went inside this CVS on East Butler Avenue in Ambler on April 3rd and filled CVS gift bags with more than $1,200 worth of merchandise. Less than an hour later, police say the suspects hit this CVS on 2nd. Street Pike in Richboro, where the suspects allegedly grabbed gift bags again and filled them with $4,000 worth of over the counter medications. On both occasions, police say the men are seen walking into the stores empty handed before fleeing in a dark colored sedan with stolen goods worth thousands of dollars. I'm shocked about that, seriously. I didn't even saw that people do stuff like that. It's a shame that this happened. CBS customers in Richboro say they're surprised this happened at what they say is normally a quiet location. Nancy Nowicki says she often gets her prescriptions from this location and says she never really sees more than two or three employees working at the same time. Cashiers, there's only a couple, and maybe that's the problem. They need more people watching. This is an issue Joe Dombronski says is affecting everyone from the inner city to the burbs. He says he'd like to see some accountability for the suspects and says anyone thinking of doing the same should think twice. It's ridiculous. They need to work for stuff and, and make the money and buy it. Yeah, and if you recognize the suspects, you're asked to give Northampton Township Police or Ambler Police a call. We're live tonight in Ambler. Charles Watson for Action News at 10 on PHL 17. Shari. All right, we'll keep the video out on our website, too. All right, Charles, thanks. Atlanta